In this lesson, we're going to go over how to change a verb to the casual past affirmative, a verb that's a class one verb, okay? This is a very difficult subject, but uh, we've broken it down, made it very easy. Um, we've started with some memory mnemonics, okay? We have kui we have sushi, we have moon boom, and lutsu, okay? The mnemonics tells you what to do. Let's start with the first one, quigui, okay? It, if it ends in ku or gu, change it to e. So if it ends in ku, change it to e, or if it ends in gu, change it to e. Quigui, okay? Then you add ta or da, respectively. If it ends in ku, change it to ta. If it ends in gu, change it to da. Okay, here's an example. Kaku, to write. Um, it ends in ku, so you change it to e. Change ku to e is e. And then add ta. Ta goes with ku. So kaku becomes kaita. Okay? Another one. Oyogu. Okay? It ends in gu. Okay? So you change it to e. In kuigui. Gu becomes e. Oyo e. Then you add da. Da goes with gu, respectively. Okay? So ta goes with ku, and da goes with gu. Okay, next, uh, sushi. Okay? If it ends in su, change it to shi. Okay? Then add ta. Okay, hanasu, to speak or to talk. Okay? If it ends in su, change it to shi. Hanasu becomes hanashi ta, at ta. Hanasu hanashita. Okay? Next, moon boom. Okay? If it ends in moon, change it to in. If it ends in boo, change it to in. Moon boom. Moon boom. Okay? Then add da. So, yomu. Ends in mu, change it to n. Then add da. Yomu becomes yomda, okay? Asobu ends in bu, change it to n. Asobu becomes asonda, asonda. Okay, lastly, lutsu. Okay, this one, you don't do anything, okay? If it ends in lu, if it ends in u, or if it ends in su, okay? U or U or Tsu. Don't do anything. There's nothing here to do with these. So you just basically drop them. You drop U, you drop U, or you drop Tsu. Then you add Ta. For example, Kaeru. Ends in Ru, you drop it. Kae, then you add Ta. Kaeta. Okay? Kau. Ends in U. So you drop it and you add ta, kata. And lastly, tsu, motsu. Ends in tsu, just drop it, add ta, becomes mota. Okay? That's basically all you need to do. Remember, kuigui, sushi, mumbu, or butsu. Okay? Let's go over an example. Cake talked. Hanasu means to talk or to speak. So, to translate this, we write cake wa hana. Now, hanasu ends in su, so we use sushi. Hana shi. Hanashita, okay? Kekwa Hanashita, okay? Let's go over another example. Let's go over some simple problems. Let's 
do this one at a time. I wrote reports, okay? Um, to write is kaku. So, okay, translate this, and we'll go over it together. Okay, let's go over it. I wa report oh um, no plural kaku okay for this one you use quigui it ends in ku change to e kaita eta I wa report o kaita. Okay, let's go over another example. You bought shirts, okay? The word for to buy is kau. Okay, kau means to buy. So, okay, go ahead, translate that. Okay, ready? Let's go over it. Shirt o, then to buy ko. Now we use lu su to um, the memory mnemonic lu su to know what to do. So it ends in u. So we use ka ta. Okay. You wa shirt o kata. Okay. So that's basically it. Um, remember quigui sushi. Moon Boom and Lucy. And that's it. I'll see you next time.